going to do a trellis repair. This cross section is kind of broken. So I'm going to replace it with this new piece of wood. Boom, freshly rebuilt pole bean trellis. And I'm gonna do some more soil prep with the containers. So I stir up the soil and then fill the container halfway full. With the other half of the soil, I'll mix in some perlite, some vermiculite, a little bit of azomite, and then some earthworm castings. I'll add this stuff about every two or three years. You don't have to do it all the time. And fill it up the rest of the way. Zucchini cage soil complete. <laughs> These containers are too big and heavy to pick up. So I'll remove about a foot of the soil into a wheelbarrow. And I'll stir up the soil at the bottom of the container. I'm all set and ready to plant. And in the next week, two weeks, I will be planting all of these seedlings. It's April 2nd and the fig trees are starting to grow shoots. There's fresh green little leaves growing, but tonight it's supposed to get down to 25 degrees. It's a hard freeze, so I'm gonna cover these with blankets. It got down to 25.7 degrees last night.
crispy coating of frost. We'll have to wait and see. It looks like a lot of them have died. Got freeze damage, but we'll check back later. It's four days later. The green leaves have freeze damage, but they're still nice green buds. So the plants will still survive and bounce back. Here's a look at the fig tree cuttings that I took last year. They're all leafed out. And this is where I've been keeping them over the winter to keep them alive, ready for this year.